you, you couldn't deal with him. He was a dictator. He was out of control. He, he would have broke the band up if we tried to stop him. You know, what, it, what was our choices? And so there's this war in there. It's, it's this battle inside of a book. And to come out the other side of that, for me now, to come out the other side of it and be able to, like I said, reconcile it, clean it up, um, make amends or forgive in some cases where people were just, in my opinion, just fucking wrong. You know, there's so many emotions attached to this book. It doesn't make me look good. And a lot of people have said to me, including publishers, are you sure you want to do this? And I said, yeah, I think, it, I think the honesty is the most important part of this book. And the music being inspired from that. It's been great working with Nikki because He's such a true artist and he gives me, you know, I mean we both have so much respect for each other, but he gives me all the freedom in the world just to paint our picture. All of a sudden it started happening. Uh, Nikki would call me and say, hey man, we just, you know, did an arrangement on this song, it's great. brilliant thing is, you know, you said from the get-go there was no rules, you know, just yeah. an open canvas to paint on, and I think that's what made it easier for all of us to bring that, the chapter by chapter to life, you know. So. Absolutely. But we just got to find a, a cool phrase that's like, you know, this this universe. February 14th, 1987, I've decided to do something for Valentine's Day to mark the anniversary of the day I died. Anniversary of the day I died. Yeah, because I died on Valentine's Day in London. It says I had overdosed in London okay. exactly a year earlier. Valentine's Day 1986, we had played Hammersmith Odeon, and the second we left the stage, I caught a taxi with Andy McCoy from Hanoi Rocks. We took, he took me to a heroin apartment in the real shabby neighborhood. I was drunk, and I remember I was impressed that the dealer had clean needles. I offered, he, when he offered to shoot me up, I let him. Big mistake. And then it goes on. Everybody gets high, everybody gets low, everybody gets bruised, everybody gets so It's the struggle with the addictive personality and really coming from it from an angle that, that I believe is, is honest. Uh, 